Paris, by Guy Redmore Carroll. I knew when first I looked into her eyes, and she and mine, that what has been must be, and so let others say she told them lies. She told no lie to me. She spoke me fair, of less as well as wine, when, with its subtlest charm of all her charms, half dropped her languid lids, and at the sign I ran into her arms. No, it is she who flings my window wide at dawn, at the perfect morning in, and she awoke so softly at my side through noonday's dust and din. But most of all, it is she, where blue night falls, whose firm imperious fingers tap the pain, and she whose feathered voice it is that calls, who calls her own in vain. It is as if the siren understood how that she is so strong at this still hour, and I could not repulse her, would, nor would, had I the power. As if she knew that, should I try to check the strength of that enwrapped, responsive thrill, that I but slight her arm about my neck, and I obey her will. So when she speaks her answer, when she woos, her voice like wine, the slow pulse goes and spurs, I go to meet her through the doping juice, and lend my lips to hers. All the long hours run laughing into one, the strange sweet moment when the evening falls, and, like a mother's the morning as sun, resistless Paris calls.